Atomizing air and liquid fuel are injected into each combustor through a liquid fuel nozzle. The atomized fuel is ignited by a spark plug. Once the reaction is started, the combustion process is self-sustaining as long as fuel and air are available. When normal trip oil pressure is established, VH4-1 allows hydraulic oil to flow to the actuator of the liquid fuel stop valve. The stop valve opens and liquid fuel flows to the fuel pump. Once 33FL-2 signals that the liquid fuel stop valve is open, the control system energizes the solenoid of the liquid fuel pump clutch. The clutch is engaged and the fuel pump is driven by the accessory drive gear. Fuel flows to the bypass valve and the flow divider. The flow divider sends an equal amount of liquid fuel to each combustor. Magnetic speed pickups in the flow divider sense the rate of fuel flow and provide the control system with signals proportional to the amount of fuel being sent to the turbine. The control system compares the called for fuel flow to the actual rate of flow sensed by the magnetic speed pickups. When the demand for fuel increases, the control system begins to close the bypass valve. As the bypass valve closes, more fuel is forced to the flow divider.